we can see here that SPSS has reported a correlation matrix. The matrix is mirrored on the diagonal, so we only need to look at the bottom left or the top right corner. SPSS first reports the correlation coefficient. We denote this with an italicized lowercase r with a pb subscript. This is interpreted in the same way as Pearson's r, with the values ranging from negative 1 to 1. Below this, SPSS reports the significance level, or p-value, for the correlation. And finally, SPSS reports the sample size for the correlation. As only one point by serial correlation was performed, the results could be presented in a statistical sentence, such as, a point by serial correlation identified a significant positive relationship between gender and price paid for the album. You would then report the correlation coefficient and p-value. When performing multiple correlations, it is more appropriate to present the results in a table.